let's set up a live stream for X, formerly known as Twitter. Download and install OBS from the link in the description, then hit profile at the top and click on new. I've named mine X streaming and I'm ticking show auto config wizard. I'm optimizing for streaming. We're going 1920 by 1080 and 60 FPS. Underneath service, I'm choosing the Twitter option. And now I'm gonna click on get stream key. This is gonna pull up the producer. I'm gonna click create source in the top right corner. I've named mine OBS stream key. I am choosing the closest region and I'll click create. Next up, I'm gonna copy this stream key. I'm gonna head back into OBS and paste it into the box. I'm gonna prefer hardware encoding. I'm gonna uncheck estimate bitrate and I'm simply gonna set the bitrate to 6,000. The server is gonna match what I chose and I chose Paris, so I'm gonna match it with France. I'm gonna press next. These are great settings, so I'll press apply. And at this stage, I'm also gonna click scene collection new and I've named it X scenes and I'll press okay. Next up, I'm gonna click settings, which is behind where my head is. And we're gonna go on to output. Double check your bit rate is on 6,000 and then move to audio. I'm gonna add my desktop audio, which is my cloud to wireless. And I'm gonna add my quadcast microphone. Click in the video, make sure you're 1920 by 1080 and 60 FPS and press okay. Underneath my mic, I'm clicking the three dots, clicking filters, clicking the plus, adding noise suppression or N noise or one of the Nvidia options. That's gonna remove fans, AC, etc. Let's add our display and add our camera. I'll click the plus button. I'm going to choose display capture, press OK, find the correct display underneath the display option. Capture cursor, press OK to add it in. If you need to move it, click on it and you can drag it around. And same for camera, I'll press the plus button. I'll choose video capture device. You can name it differently if you want. I'll choose my USB live camera, which is my second lower quality camera. We're going to set it to custom and then we're going to set it to 1080p. So make sure you have the highest FPS available. Make sure you're on a minimum of 1080p. I'm going to click on the camera and I'm now going to drag the corners to resize it. There we go. I did that a little bit wrong there. So let's drag it down here. If you want to crop it, like if I wanted to crop the side out, hold alt and just drag the squares. If you want to center it perfectly, right click transform. This one is centered vertically. And if you want to make sure you don't accidentally click on it, we're now going to lock both of them. When you're ready, just hit the start streaming button. You're not actually live yet. We have to go to studio.twitter.com slash producer slash broadcasts. In the top right corner, click create broadcast. Give it a name, I'll call mine test. Choose a category, I'll choose the tech category. Underneath source, OBS stream key, which we've already chosen. After a few seconds, the preview should pop up at the top. Choose any other options that you want. For example, I'll let everyone chat. I'll turn on the hearts and we'll start it immediately. Other options should be fine. I'm now gonna click create broadcast. At the top, we've now got a link to our broadcast. We can click on it to confirm that the broadcast is working. And as you can see, I am now successfully live on X. Make sure you end the stream inside OBS and also end the stream in the producer. Check out this tutorial to add donations to your Twitter X stream.